Morning everybody. Right, this is the bike I'm giving to JP. But the tyres are flat, well flattish. Um, and I've struggled and struggled to get the caps off but I've managed it now. I'm all ready to start it pumping. It makes quite a noise. So I didn't press it yet because I'm very considerate of neighbours and things. And there's someone over there called Neil filming away. Um, you know, when I'm filming, he don't mind coming past on the lawnmower and making a racket. But I'm I'm nice like that. I'll wait till he's finished. Yeah, JP, come in today to see me. Ooh, and something exciting turning up. I'm getting a microscope. There we go, all pumped up. 36 PSI, which isn't a lot, but that's what it says on the tyres. Now, yeah, I'm used to riding bigger tyres now. <laughs> like, even these are thin. But looking at these, they're so small and skinny. But these are the old ones, they actually changed them to these chunkier ones, which Mazzy's bike has. But I looked online, and you can actually buy a pair of them for 30 pounds from my rider so I'll be recommending to JP he gets them because these are not suitable for off-road these are more like city bike tires but yeah one bike ready to go another sticker from Bevan Bryant who stayed in the pod and apparently we didn't get to meet them when they did stay there earlier in the year where we're going. So a little gap there needs fitting. No, go down here. Right in the corner, underneath me. Yeah, they are actually campsite wardens for the caravanning and camping and caravanning park or something. Right. Just found out JP's pitch number. It's next to us. They're on pitch 10, just here which is a nice place to be because there is a hedge in between us both so he can't see what I'm doing but we know he's there if I need him for anything getting excited now hi JP and Sam is coming to see us good morning I'm here too I'm cold today it's absolutely freezing <laughs> come on outside yeah want to say sorry Big sorry to the lovely lady oh. who came over with loads of lovely gifts for us, yep. including a Scotch egg challenge I was meant to be doing with Neil. Yes. And he was busy the day before yesterday. I put it off yesterday. I thought we'll do it today. But the lady has left this morning and apparently she says, don't eat them now. I bought them on Saturday. Which seems a shame. It's Tuesday today. I'm no, really... it's Thursday today. Was it Thursday? Thursday. So we're absolutely oh. gutted. Got it. Because what it was is five different scotch eggs, all different flavours, and we were going to cut them in half, and me, me, I have half, Neil has half, and we have to guess what that they are. That was so unfortunate, because you were actually really... I love scotch... We both... Everyone Do loves you scotch really eggs. think these are had it? They're it says on the bottom, look. Right, what? tomato. I wouldn't like tomato. I don't like tomato. Chilli. Chilli. Plain. Bacon. Bacon. Oh, black pudding. Absolutely I'm keeping gutted. these though, look. Yeah, definitely. Chuck me. Sweet yeah. chilli jam. That so, is such a, I'm so sorry about that. No, well, Extremely it's, sorry. It's my fault. Completely well, my fault. It, it was because we couldn't match it up with Neil on most of those days as well, could we? Let me just put these down. <sighs> Never mind. And, sh and you've left another lovely gift as you've gone, which has got Mazzy well excited. Oh my gosh, I'm so... I can't believe it when Dan came back with this. Can't believe it. <laughs> right. I am overwhelmed. Because we've got one of these, oh, it's but rubbish. it is rubbish. It's, it was donated by Neil, basically. Yeah. And it's, it's rubbish. Handy. <laughs> it's very hard to put up, whereas yeah. this is easy. It's easy. There's no like pull it up so far and screw something underneath. Yeah. It just clicks in place, clicks in place, bang. And you know what? Beautiful. It looks wider at the bottom so it shouldn't t tip over so much. That's my old one, look. Go show me the old yeah, one. Yeah, this is the old one. <laughs> it looks like it's from 1983 and it probably is. Yeah, but it did the job. Just, just. I still would have had that. So you've got that. Yeah, oh, I'm so grateful. On top of that, 
you know, this is handy for the nice weather days. Yeah. But we're coming up to winter now, Mazzy. I know. What? You can't really dry clothes anymore now, can you? Because... You can if you go out you with can. me. You can. <laughs> and because I go out with you. <laughs> Sorry, I'm really cold today. <laughs> so on Saturday, there is something special coming from Mazzy. I'm ecstatic over and over the moon. I've been given so many gifts. And also, we had the lovely Mark come over this morning, didn't we? Yeah. Let's go and show him what he gave Mark's us. Mark's going. He's departing. He's departing and leaving us. Moving on to pastures new. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He gave us a big box of vegetables. Look at this lot. Now look how much. He went to... This is actually from, like, the butchers. Well, it won't be from a butcher's, will it? No, the um, greengrocers, I mean. Yeah, but I said butchers, did <laughs> So... We've got loads of vegetables and loads of fruits, and we don't even know what these are. No, Mark, My guess did, is Mark mango. didn't even know what they are. My guess is mango. I'm, I can make some lovely meals with that. Someone tell us what they are. Yeah, let us know. So, yeah, well, look, pears, apples. I've got no room in the fridge at the minute. I'm going to have to try and juggle a few things around. They don't have to go in the fridge. It's not fridge stuff. Mm. So... My animals are going to eat fantastically. No, they're not. No, they're not. You can get that out of your head. He said they were for a while, say Phil. A big thank you to Mark and the lovely Sam, and I'm going to miss you both. I'm going to miss you both, and and I hope your next travels and journey is just as good as what you've had this year. God, I hope it's twenty times better. Why? Anyway, there's one I last thing before it. we cut this clip, what? which is turning into a longish one. Yeah, it is. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> Are you ready? Oh, I'm just. We gonna... wish you a merry Christmas. We oh, yeah. wish you a merry Christmas. <laughs> we wish you a merry Christmas and a happy new year. I said, oh no, this is the start of it now. <laughs> Our first Christmas card from Ada and Tina. Thank, Thank you, you very, so very much. much. Yeah. Uh, and beer as well. But we've We've been getting bits and bats. Yeah, we might man. be forgetting something, but thank you for every. Oh, and I, some Aribos as well, I think. Yeah, we've got Aribos for this. Look, gonna put it next to the pumpkin, and it's all seasonal going on there. Look. Yeah. <laughs> kind of matches though, don't it? Not really, no. Christmas, mm. autumn. Christmas, autumn. No. Oh, I'm well gutted about them eggs. Yeah. Never mind. Yeah. Never mind. No yeah, one I got hurt. It was Tuesday, and I thought maybe we could try them, but no, not if it's. At better, least we've so. got them lovely jams to try. Yeah. So sorry about that, though. I feel awful about that. And we well, love you. We love ya. We've got guests. Oh God! As oh, friends are here. As friends are here. <laughs> <laughs> My best friends are here. <laughs> 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 Hey. Oh. How have you been? Oh, what, mate? Right. Oh, there's another one hey, over there. Hey, Look. Hey, oh, this is lovely. Oh. Oh, lovely to see you. Hey, yeah. And where's my other one? Hey, 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 hello, darling. Whoa, how exciting. It's a microscope. Doesn't look like one. <laughs> I think I've set it up wrong. But it is a microscope, trust me. I was saying to you, I remember them at school, you know when like they had like three cylinders and a thing you looked down in and they were big and chunky and heavy. Well, this is digital, you see. So I can see everything on the screen, what is happening, and put an SD card in and record it. So where you're actually putting your items, your slides, etc. Well, that's the microscope. Oh, so you pull it down there? Well, this is what I'm not really understanding. It's as if it should be a lot further back. Maybe that will just... That doesn't seem far enough back, but it may, might be there, yeah. Look, you've got these lovely little table lamps as well, look. <gasps> cool, that's sweet, babe. That's sweet. Yeah. This it's going to change my trail cam dam channel completely. <laughs> Your life. You've been talking about God knows what you want to put under there, haven't you? I said about putting a bit of Donna meat under it. Wildlife, <laughs> I'm going to put wildlife. I want to see interesting stuff. I want to see swabs taken. 
like toilet swabs. I want to see a bit of Donna meat under there. I want to see tarantula skin and stuff like that. Well, I might be able to help you on the tarantula skin. I think I've got some of that hanging around somewhere. Jolly good morning to one and all. How are you today? It's autumn, it's proper autumn. Today it's going to feel 7 degrees all day, but it's actually 11 degrees outside. Full sun and we've got it for 3 or 4 days. How wonderful. Right, you might recall we've been having a bit of a problem with this fridge. Whenever we go off site and the fridge freezer um, defrosts, it's all ended up over the floor. And as you can see it actually stained the carpet last time. We're getting a big wet patch down here every time we go off grid and this thaws out so um mr jp came up with an idea well i did actually it was my idea it was my idea we're going to clean the pipe out it might just have a little blockage in it so i've told jp to order a special tool and here it is there's the tool yeah well done what's then. this then <laughs> so it's a tiny little cute brush and you stick it up the Tube, tube, <laughs> and that one's going to go up your tube if you carry on. That oh. one and that just flushes it out. Oh, it looks disgusting, it really does. So, we're going to give that a go, see if that's going to help. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Um, yeah, this is the weather today. Look, it's beautiful. It is beautiful. Yesterday, what was the rain like oh, yesterday? Biblical, wasn't it? Bibli literally biblical. All day solid hardcore rain all day and puddles everywhere now this is a notorious puddle it's gone down a lot since yesterday night um, but yeah really bad all our you can still see it here look it's it is wet through but hopefully with this there's a nice wind it's cool and it's sunny. I think it's going to dry out nicely today. You couldn't walk down here yesterday. It was just really, really wet. That, wow, it nearly went over my ankles walking through there. But it's subsiding rapidly. Hey, looking forward to today. So, I haven't really put much on this channel apart from the odd review lately. But we've just been chilling out the last couple of days, catching up with JP and Sammy and having a good time, but it's time to get to work. On this channel now, just to let you know, there is only one review left. And you'll be happy to know. And it's the EP500 Pro from Blue Etty, so I've got to crack on with that at some point. And then with no more reviews, for the time being, you'll be happy to know. So, are you ready for the day? Looks like it. Let's do yeah. this. Right, so we're going in for the jug. It's in here. Yeah, you take it off. You hold the camera there. It's not held in very securely, as you can tell. <laughs> Where's my jug gone? Oh, here's my jug. Oh, right. Which is this? Stuck on the pipe there. Oh, there we are. Right, it's empty. Right. Completely empty. Mm -hmm. Nearly empty, look. Ah, so there's your pipe. Right. So that's the pipe. So that's that pipe. is what you want to that's try and what pull I want through. To shove something up. Yeah. up. yeah, go on. I'll let you take the glory. It's very easy. All you do is put that in there. I know you're looking for glory, glory aren't you? Yeah, I'll have a bit of glory, me. Right, let's have a look. Will it fit in? That's the big question. <sighs> He's had new tattoos put on his arm, by the way. Right, let's have a go here. Is it in? It's, oh, going, it's, it's going, going in. in. Oh, 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 it's oh, blocked. Oh, oh, it's going. Oh, there's a bit of a... Is it a bit best to start out in here? We're giving it a back end unplug first. Oh, something Good just morning. went pop. Some, pop. Something popped. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, look at all that muck. Uh, let's have a look. Hey. It's mucky. Did, is there a hole on the inside, then? Yeah. Let's, oh, have a get let's have a look in your fridge. <laughs> yeah, so I've sorted it. Well so, done. So basically, stuck this in from the other side and it pushed up and we felt, didn't we? We Did felt you... like a blockage and pushed it a little bit harder and 
pop you can the see the muck on the end of here and a tiny bit of muck has actually come out of the pipe at the fridge end on the inside so it should now be clear shouldn't it it should be well done then thank you very brilliant. much brilliant job so job well done so all i need to do now is put the put the um tubey thing back into the jug but the only thing is it's a very small jug very small jug so once that's full it's just going to overflow and surely go all over the electrics I don't know you can, yeah yeah okay so we're looking at the tube here oh ooh. oh no that's just the brush <laughs> I thought, oh, there is a bit of muck there, look. Right, the brass come all the way through? It did. I think you might need to do it again. Because a little bit of muck stayed on the end then. But yeah, you could you can see the bit of muck there, what was stuck in it. Jobs are good, aren't I can't believe it just goes into a little jug there, that's odd, isn't it? What's that there? It is odd. Is that Maybe that's where it would flow out of. See, what I think the odd... But what you could do is, is maybe extend that tube, put it down there, and see where that goes. Comes out under here somewhere. It's fixed, it's sorted, no problems. Thanks for coming, JP. It's been lovely seeing you. Lovely, thank you. Oh, there is a hole here. Yeah. Let's get on with our day. Our day. How to make a job more complicated. Oh, how to make a job effective and last forever rather than it going into a little pot, sloshing around, going over all over your electrics. What we're going to do. The, the little pipe what came out, instead of going into a little pot, we're going to have get a fish tank pipe connector type thing and have a tube coming down here into this grill which basically goes straight outside it underneath goes, it the goes ground. Through a tube. So we're going to get a tube going down there and that'll create, that'll stop and the then problem. we'll never have a problem again. Yeah, because when I think Craig fixed this, didn't he? When well, he fi I fixed it. Oh, yeah. All right. You fixed it. But then I think that's what was happening. The water's sloshing out that little pot going on now. So if you run it directly out of there, yeah. it's not going to have that problem, are you? Yeah. There we go. Fix. Job, job. Get Jobs are good, aren't I'll put this back. So just sat here talking about YouTubers fighting professional boxers. Tonight it is Tommy Fury against KSI. He wants KSI to get his head kicked in. I personally want K basic KSI is a YouTuber. Tommy Fury is a professional boxer. Okay. Um, they shouldn't really be fighting each other, but it's a big money thing. Loads of money involved. They're going to make a fortune. Why not? Now, um, this has gone back, I don't know, five, seven years where YouTubers are offering YouTubers out and stuff like that. It all started with KSI against... Who was the other? Freakish Face, wasn't it? The first... No, no, no. Oh, KSI and Logan Paul. Logan Paul. The Paul brothers. Logan Paul. They started it, I think, by offering the other a fight and it, it's just gone from there. So, I want to do this live on this channel right now I want to offer a fight to another YouTuber JP me and you in the <laughs> ring Manchester Arena December the 8th what do you think yeah fine mate yeah no say no say no. oh no you no why why can't you do it then oh, I've got something on that day I've got to um, no. go to the chiropody set because, day Shh, just say it. No, just not. say it for the camera. Why won't you fight I me can't. on the 10th of December in Manchester Arena? I can't say it. Say it. Because I'm... Say it. No, I can't say it. Please don't make me say, say it. Say it now. Come not say it or I'll hit you. <laughs> <laughs> say it. it be like... It, it You're being, spoiling video. It say it. it. Like being just say it or I'm going to hit you. Feather duster. Why won't okay. you? Okay, I won't. I won't fight you because I'm scared. Thank you very I'm much. Really I told you. I I'm told really, you. I'm scared. I'm well, really don't hurt. say I didn't put the offer out there. <laughs> Could have made a million pounds. Me and you, Manchester Arena, big fight. <laughs> and he's bottled it. What a wimp! <laughs> nice pants, Mazzy. What do they say? Love. Have a nice day. Badass and what? That's a badass. <laughs> what does that say? <laughs> I don't know. Don't know. Then we slouchy about um, uh, bottoms today because I'm washing. 
the dreaded washing day can be exciting. Have you seen what I've got? What Dan got me, look. Russell oh. Hobbs tumble dryer. Look at that tumble dryer. I'm about to turn it on. I need to go get a tumble dryer sheet and turn it on for the first time. I'll be back. The plan is, hopefully, when we've moved pitch, what I'm planning on doing is having a tiny setup in the corner of the awning which will have the washing machine and tumble dryer on top of it possibly connected to a power bank I doubt we'll be keeping that uh, but connected to a power bank which will be connected to a solar panel and be running electricity free that's the plan um, so we've actually plugged it into this now so we're going to be able to see yeah. how many watts this I've takes. I've not ever used this before have I? So, so you've put some smalls in there. Yep. Just turn the dial Mazzy surely. What? I don't think you need to go that far. Yeah it's not hot. I should have read the instructions. Is it plugged in? It's... I don't know. It might be. No it's not on on now. Oh, don't do that to me. <laughs> I'm getting all excited. Right, ready? Yep. <laughs> right. Oh my God. It is on. It is going round. And I'll tell you what, that is quiet. That's not bad, is it? And I can get an awful lot in there as well. That is so quiet. My worry was it was going to be too loud. Right, how many watts does this take? It looks a lot actually. Ooh, yeah. almost a thousand watts. Yeah, but we're going to get a thousand pieces of clothing dry, <laughs> aren't we? <laughs> That's a lot of watts, Mazzy. <laughs> what? <laughs> um, so, there's only 24% on this, so you can say times four if this was full. 28 minutes, 27 minutes, you can get nearly two hours, about one hour 50 out of a full one of these of So that's of drying. probably only three to four loads. Okay. Because it could be 40 minutes. But the plan will be... But we don't know. You're that. not going to be drying all day every day, are you? The plan is, <laughs> these will be getting charged up through solar. Yes. And then by the time we come to need this, we'll have all the power to do it. Yeah. And I think it'll work. It'll work fine, yeah. But it's a great little setup now I have here. I have to be honest though, that is better than I expected. It is really quiet. I wish it had been less watts, but never mind, as long as yeah, we can get a three dryer is electric. totally different, isn't it? And, and it's working. It's working, thanks babe. You are welcome. Boom, boom. Thank you. <laughs> So we've done as test. Done a first load. 40 How long? minutes. 40 minutes. Well, I gave it 40 minutes before I checked it. So Is it bone dry? Bone dry, bone dry. I've got these out drying on my new line. Yeah. Uh, just as much as it can. You know, I want to save electric as well. Um, so that has used 20%. That has used 10%. So that isn't bad, at, you know, we can cope with that. And then now we will link them up to the solar panel and get them on to 100% ready for next time. And bear in mind, wash day isn't every day anyway, is it? It's no. just now and again, so. It's gonna work, it's, it's gonna going work. To work. We've been thinking about things, how we're gonna do it, because, yeah. Well, the setup at the moment is just a 200, a 200 watt solar panel, which is mucky at the moment. It's not even stood up, so it's not getting as many watts in as it could. What I want to do, there's a few companies being in touch offering like um, 500 watt solar panels for a review type thing. I do know Bob over there has got one which stands up. I don't know how big it is, is, is but it, it's got like uh, legs at the back and it stands up properly. So if we could get one of them and just have everything charging at the same time, we're not going to be using any power. Ideal, I'll be honest, ideally, we'd like to run the entire van just off solar because Bob's managing to do that, which means we don't then have to pay electric bills for the campsite. 
But for now, as long as we can charge all these extra bits, we're happy. But in the long term, maybe we'll look at trying to do what Bob is doing over there. But yeah, a result. I'm uh, quietly happy at how that's gone because that, you can't even tell it's on, it's so quiet. And the beauty about it being out here, you just open up the awning side and the vents at the back, it's coming straight out. Results. I don't think we've actually told you, but we are going away in a couple of days. Um, we're going to Harrogate. Harrogate, very posh area in Yorkshire. Um, a special event. Now, Mazzy bought this for me. Um, it's most haunted, you know, with Yvette Fielding. It's like a live being part of the audience kind of thing. Kind of thing. Um, and we were looking at getting tickets for Sammy and JP to come with us, but we couldn't get tickets sat next to each other or something like that. So what we've agreed is Sammy can have my ticket. They're gonna go to Most Haunted, and me and JP will be stuck alone for a full night um, on a campsite. So what we're gonna get up to, I don't know. But uh, yeah, just to break away for a few days, that's gonna be fantastic. So, we need to get ready to go away because we're not ready. Right, you've got to be Mazzy. Just sound like Mazzy in the background, do what Mazzy does. So we would like to thank the following people for our super thanks. A massive thank you to Jacob Clayton. Yay, thank you Jacob. A bit louder, she's Sorry. louder than that, she's really loud. Uh, Martin Ray. Yay, thank you Martin Ray. No, you sounded like a man then. Oh, thank you Martin Ray, oh lovely. And a big thank you to JMZWLVT. Yeah, thank you to you too. Thank you. <laughs> Many thanks for your super thanks. We really appreciate it. <laughs> Yay! Can we stop talking about tumble dryers now? No, we're talking about tumble dryers. You just got a new uh, one, didn't you, JP? Yes. Well, Sammy, Sammy did. did. <laughs> Treated Sammy to a tumble dryer. You have completely ruined the clip I was just going to film. Completely turning up here with your zero percent Guinness um, I was going to talk about the chair your chairs okay but now Do you're you here to move? well in a moment yeah you will know more about them so this mm. is Sammy's new chair now as I don't like and I'll tell you why it's one of these where you can put like a legs out thing which mm. is all stuck behind here at the moment yep. I don't like the look of them they look flimsy with them legs on is it going to last? Yeah. You've, well, you've got a mucky well, mark there. Look, you look curry. Yeah, it's bad as that. <laughs> so I don't like that one personally, but I do like yours. Right, this is where you get up. See. Robins, never heard of them, mm -hmm. but I like it. Very nice. Chair. I like the handles. It holds down really nicely as well. That one. I love the setup of it. Is it comfy though? Oh no, it's horrible. <laughs> Change my mind, go get one of them. They're not comfortable at all. You feel like you're sat in a school chair. Do you like it though? I like it. That's the main thing. So that's the main thing. Right. It takes up no room, folds down really small, so I'm happy days. We need to speak to Mazzy now because you've just come and suggested something to do for the next hour. What? He wants to know if we want to go down to the pub for an hour. He's such a man. Fancy walk down the pub just for a couple of pints just to get off the site. Oh yeah, but I've got all that washing. Right, we'll go then. We'll see can you later. Can I do? Give us a give us. That's what? Right. Do wash, bang it in the old tumble dryer. Because you, did you know you got an, you got no? A we don't dryer. need tumble dryer now because the weather's no. perfect for this look. If I told We've him, just I've got a new tumble dryer. No, yeah, I've got a new tumble got dryer. A tumble I, dryer. I've got a new it's tumble it. dryer, JP. Oh, is that it? Wow, thank you for well being taken interest. Look at that. Posh in it. Wow. <laughs> That's well good. Can we talk about something else apart from the tumble dry? Oh, let's talk about microscopes or trail oh, cam, shall we? Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, microscopes. <laughs> wow. I've got my microscope office out here at the moment. Seriously. Need to have a massive, massive plan 
on how I'm going to fit everything in the right place when we move over to his new pitch because this is getting out of control bits and bats everywhere got to remember this would normally be folded up not a problem there wouldn't be as much in them not a problem we're windling it down there is more room available but in here at the moment it's just crazy it is just out of control I had this empty the other mind you you've got to remember these won't be here so that's taking up half of the room um, this probably won't be staying uh, we might even get rid of a couple of these I don't know it, we're gonna dwindle everything down aren't we we are yeah and if Turn anyone's it. interested no 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 <laughs> no not yet well with that big one we know that's definitely going but that's brilliant we don't know we don't know it's brilliant we just haven't got the room we ideally want to keep that but it's not really suitable for what we want it's just we haven't got the room it's getting a bit overcrowded it's heavy it's heavy <laughs> awesome, it? it is Good lovely quality one right so what are we doing are we going to the pub or not no you have to bear with me yeah but when not, not waiting all day it's, it's saturday know. it's 12 o'clock it's gonna be busy it's down there time. Well, i've still got to go i don't know why don't you lads go then well sammy's coming oh okay well we'll go then i'll be ready in a minute no sammy's safe. i'll be ready in a minute <laughs> Why didn't you just come over and said you want to come for a drink and she'd have let me out? She'd have let me out. We could have just said we're going trail camping and got down a pub. Yeah, but you came over. Oh, would you two like to come to well, pub? Well, I'll be sociable. Well, don't. Sociable don't. people do. Right, uh, me and JP and the lovely Sammy and Mazzy are off out for, for an hour down pub. Um, we'll see you all on the next one.